107 left. Ball is at the eight-yard line. Here, Brett Favre, you want to challenge? Try this one. And Favre completes on first down to Harry Sidney, who gets a little running room and gets out of bounds to stop the clock. You can see the veteran smarts of Sidney. He knew what to do. Ricardo McDonald ran him out for Cincinnati. Brett Favre certainly has his work cut out for him today. So does this man, Mike Holmgren, who will be the real architect of this drive, calling all the plays. Second down, seven for the pack. Ball unleashes it and gets it to Sterling Sharp out across midfield to the 46-yard line. Rod Jones making the stop for Southern Methodist. Second big catch of the quarter for Sharp. Clock running. Sharp is hurt. It's the same injury he had when he scored the touchdown. It's a rib injury. Hard to get his hands up over his head, but he did that to make that last catch. Over the middle, here comes Workman. And now the Packers must use a timeout. No, they don't have one left. Clock running with the ball at the 35. No timeouts remaining. Barr will stop the clock here, and he does. Barr, with his leading receiver, Big play man, Sterling Sharp holding that rib. Uh, what an effort by Sharp. It, it's, a, it's a very painful injury. Anytime you hurt any of those ribs, but here, he, he knows it's hurting, but he's still got to reach up and go for that ball and makes that catch and then comes down on the rib again. It and was the safety man, Fernandez Vinson, who was late with the help. That allowed Sharp to run free past Rod Jones down the sideline, and he was hurting before the catch, Ahmad. It certainly was. It was right after that touchdown play, and now Sharp is on the sideline. Can't help him there. So with their best receiver out of the game, from the 35, 19 seconds left. Ball pumps, throws, touchdown!
uncertain as to what Don Mikowski was going to be able to do in Mike Holmgren's new offense. It's amazing how these looks on these two coaches have changed in the last minute and seven seconds. Brett Favre so excited. Two touchdowns on the day, 22 for 37, not to mention a few drops that he had. And of the 289 yards, Ahmad, the majority of it in two fourth quarter drives. And, and, and he just kept getting better and better as this game went on. And, and to the, the Cincinnati Bengals could not put this team out of contention. They just kept staying in it, and that's the man that kept him in it, Brett Favre. The kind of resiliency that Don Mikowski showed for the Packers in 89, Favre has had it today. He certainly has, because they had a lot of opportunities 